Hello and welcome to this short video showing you how to create a thing link and some of the tags that you can add. Click your create button. Here you can upload an image, a video, a 360 image or a 360 video. Whatever you choose to use, the tag editor offers the same functionality. I'm going to upload an image. Once processed, I'm now ready to add my tags. Click on your blue add tag and you can see that you can position your tags anywhere you would like to on your thing link. Your tag options are you can create a tour which links your thing links together. You can add content from a website. You can add a text label or you can use the powerful tag, which is a combination of text and media. And it also opens up the text in Immersive Reader. I'm going to add content from a website and I have a video that I would like to add in. I can copy the URL and in ThingLink, I paste the URL in, or that might be an embed code. I can change the icon to something more fitting. And as this is a video, I'll add in a video tag. You can also create your own icons and put those into the icon change setting. The next tag that I'm going to show you is the text label, which is a very simple text label. Great for snippets of information. I thought it'd be good to show my view is where I sourced my image and I can paste this information into a simple text tag again changing the icon for something which is fitting for the information. The next tag I'm going to add is the powerful text and media tag. Here you can add in a title and you can add in a description, which is the body of your text. And I have some information ready to go. The button URL gives me the option to add in a button if I so wish. When clicked, this will take your viewers to the source of the information or any URL you would like to populate that button with and you can change the text that appears on the button. Here you can add in an image or further videos. Here I'm going to add in a second image. If you added in further images, they would feature like a carousel. For the video, a short MP4 file provides the option to have a video. You can even upload audio or record your voice directly into the tag. Here you can see the immersive reader function, and this provides incredible functionality for your readers who might want to change their reading preferences, including translating into over 80 different languages. Again, I'm going to change my icon to something more fitting. I'm going to add a question mark and click done. My thing link's almost ready, but there's one final step. In the settings, I can change my colour scheme. I can also have tag animation, which pulses my tags, which just brings them to your viewer's attention. You can also upload audio, which plays throughout the thing link. When ready, click done. Click done again, and your thing link is ready to share. There's just a couple of more settings you might like to consider. On the settings cog, you can change the image title and select your privacy settings. Here, I want to share mine publicly. If I wanted to go back in and edit any of the functions or any of the tags, I would just simply click on the edit pen, which would take me back to the editor. My thing link is now ready to publish and share with the world. We'll look at all of those sharing options in some of the next modules, but thank you for watching and we look forward to seeing you in module five.